despite their midweek victory against Watford, Crystal Palace remain bottom of the championship table. They face a Coventry City side this afternoon with their last three games on the bounce. Downfield is picked up in defence. And played forwards, brought down inside the area by Marlon King, still looking for his first goal for the club. And the Crystal Palace defence inside and out. Kevin McCarthy. Pulling his backside by the turn for King. But his shot was well saved by Spironi. Baker. Space to get the cross into the area. And Coventry City really should have taken the lead. They may well have lost their last three matches in a row, but they remain inside the playoff positions coming into this game, and they failed to score just once in their 16 league games this season. But that was a real opportunity missed. Surely a back pass there, an unorthodox clearance, and Kieran Westwood could have got his side into some trouble there. It's a booking for James McPake for his protests. And this will provide Crystal Palace with an indirect free kick right on the edge of the six-yard box. Controversial moment here. It could be even worse for the Sky Blues. With Sheffrey in deep conversation with the referee too. Lee Carsley trying to organise the wall. Here we go. Here's... The clearance it was actually from McSheffrey back to the goalkeeper. So an indirect free kick is laid off and it's in. Darren Ambrose gives Crystal Palace the lead. It's one that A.B. Boothroyd and his players will be talking about for some time. There really can be no argument because the goalkeeper really did catch the back pass. Darren Ambrose scored against Watford in midweek a slightly injury played season for him and Sheffrey now cuts inside back onto his left foot cross up to the far post and the header is well saved Lee Carsley denied the equaliser by Julian Speroni Mr Palace haven't won back to back matches since February their goalkeeper to the rescue and Rose such a key player for Palace in their battle for the board relegation last season. Into the feet of James Vaughan. Tumbles inside the penalty area under the challenge of Richard Wood. And the referee gives a penalty. Two crucial decisions have gone against Coventry City. And Darren Ambrose here with the chance to score his second goal of the afternoon. Here's a replay of the decision. Ambrose to take it for his fourth goal of the season. Sends Kieran Westwood the wrong way. Nine minutes into the second half and Coventry City now have a mountain to climb. They're trailing by two goals to nil. And they're on course to lose for the fourth time in succession. That is the full-time whistle. Crystal Palace climb off the foot of the championship table. Two wins in the space of a week for George Bailey's men.